Hello everybody, Los Clover Boy here, Noah. Uh, I am doing a Project for Awesome video, and the video that I'm going to be doing it about, I'm going to be doing it about a charity called Feed My Starving Children that is based here in Minnesota. Minnesota is where I'm from, so let's get started. I'm going to start off by giving you a brief two-minute history of Feed My Starving Children. Along with the history, you'll be seeing a few photographs taken by Feed My Starving Children. Feed My Starving Children was founded as a Christian nonprofit in 1987 through the efforts of a Minnesota businessman who felt called by God to help feed the starving children of the world during a humanitarian visit to Honduras. He returned to the Twin Cities to develop a method of large-scale relief. In 1989, Feed My Starving Children connected with food scientists from Cargill and General Mills to develop a nutritional product especially for Feed My Starving Children to feed starving children. This product included rice, soy, vegetables, a vegetarian-based chicken flavoring, and a vitamin and mineral mix. Food scientists continued to update the formula. In addition to creating this formula, FMSC sought to develop a cost-effective means of producing the meals in quantities that would make a real difference in alleviating world hunger. Initially, FMSC tested the packaging machines, but this method proved to be expensive and cumbersome. In 1993, a church group stopped by FMSC facility to pursue volunteer opportunities with Feed My Starving Children. That providential meeting gave birth to Feed My Starving Children's volunteer packaging approach. To distribute the packaged materials, Feed My Starving Children team began establishing partnerships with major global distribution nonprofits and embedded missionaries such as Salesian Missions, Love a Child, Cross International, Samaritans International, and A World in Need. These partnerships allowed Feed My Starving Children to reach desperately needy children in remote parts of the world by leveraging the partners in country expertise. The expertise allows the partner to help ensure that the orphanages, schools, and facilities for disabled children are provided hot, nutritious meals and a ray of hope for the future. In December of 2003, Feed My Starving Children's Board of Directors voted to rededicate the organization to Christ. Since that moment, Feed My Starving Children's growth has been virtually exponential. In 2003, Feed My Starving Children produced 3 million meals with one packaging site and 17,000 volunteers. By 2010, Feed My Starving Children produced over 124 million meals with six permanent packaging sites and a nationwide mobile pack program and more than 515,000 volunteers. As with any organization, Feed My Starving Children has many different ways to donate or help out. As you can see in this picture, JB and I recently went to Feed My Starving Children and helped out and volunteered. There are also such things as mobile packs. I'll let Lily talk about that. As Noah said, there is another way to volunteer, even if you aren't able to get to a site to help pack up the food. There is something called mobile packs which they bring the supplies to you to to like your place of work or to an event or something like that and that's a great way to help out my dad actually did it at his work they brought all the stuff to his work all the supplies to make the meals so they kind of had like an assembly line and put together all the meals to pack up and put into the truck. So that's another great way to help and you can visit the website and they'll probably show you um, where you can go to to do the mobile packs. And that's another great way to volunteer. If you're interested in helping out or going to an event, you can get the link is in the description uh, for all the places and all the times uh, where the mobile packs will be. Otherwise, if you live in Minnesota or Illinois or Arizona, there are permanent packing centers in those three states. Uh, Minnesota has three, Illinois has two, and Arizona has one. So if you guys are interested in that, 
uh, look it up in, in your local state. Start helping out. If you don't have time to go out and volunteer, you can also donate using money. Feed My Starving Children, on their website, they tell you exactly how many meals you will be purchasing or how long uh, you will be purchasing for a certain child. For example, uh, five children for a month or 1,000 meals. And when you donate the money on the website, they tell you exactly what the money is going towards. And the big thing about Feed My Starving Children is 97% of the incoming money is used towards the organization. Only 3% goes to the administrative cost. Between 2 and 3% goes to the administrative cost. This is one of the highest turnovers uh, for any organization in the United States. That's what they told us at our orientation. Thanks for watching. This has been my Project for Awesome video for 2011, my very first one. So let me know how it went, and I will see you guys all later. Bye. Also, don't forget to visit their website at www.fmsc.org or their YouTube channel backslash FMSC.